Hi all, welcome back to the concept tutorial. So this is the fifth session of the uh, SSIS tutorial. So let's start with the topic. So in this topic to be covered like uh, creating SSIS package and control flow and data flow. So in this video we will see uh, what is control flow and what is data flow and uh, how it lo look like and now what what are there what things are there and why we are using control flow and data flow tasks okay so let's start with the visual studio first so you can see i have already created one a project like ssis projects so in this <coughs> you can see here that is a control flow and a data flow task okay data flow so in a control flow you can see uh, and there is a many elements like uh, parameters event handler and uh, package explorer as well but uh, whenever you click on the control flow in a control flow you can see there is a having in a ssis toolbox there is having a many uh, tasks are there so basically what what is control flow so control flow nothing but like uh, it's a it is used for like uh, managing and uh, executing the all the tasks in sequence wise SSIS package is composed of two elements that is the control flow and a data flow uh, data flow element and uh, control flow element handle workflow workflow means that we are performing some task in a step wise like suppose if I drag the data flow task from uh, SSIS toolbox and uh, then uh, I have to execute the file system task as well then I have to execute the uh, some loop container as well then I will map this through this precedence okay so this will first execute this data flow task then it will execute file system task then it will execute for loop container from this control flow don't worry about this all the tasks I will explain one by one in an excel uh, video lectures okay so that is the control flow and about the data flow it's nothing but uh, uh, element perform transformation basically all the data transformation like uh, insertion updation anything whatever you want uh, data from source to uh, like a destination like uh, extraction uh, transformation and loading the data from source to destination so you will see here is a destination assistance is there uh, like uh, if you wanted any connection from like uh, it's a uh, destination uh, like uh, where data need to be uh, insert it's a SQL server or Excel anything so most probably everyone is using the like uh, OLEDB source like suppose I I can dra drag and drop here and uh, okay then I will take the destination as well from the other destination OLEDB destination then I can connect from <coughs> here so basically data will uh, pull from the source from the database uh, and then it will go into the insertion like uh, in between uh, we can add the data transformation as well like all the type of transformation uh, data it can it will be going to be done in a data flow uh, elements only okay yeah and if you see in a control flow these all are the task of the control flow which can be visible here only uh, when you click on the control flow but if you wanted some data transformation those are <coughs> will be visible in a data flow uh, tab this called this this all we are call, called like a component these all are the components which we are uh, using for the data transformation from the source and destination okay so yeah that's it about the uh, data flow task so thank you thank you so much if is there any feedback then please provide us and uh, please subscribe and share the uh, channel thank you